I played with Crosby, Stills and Nash for 28 years. I did all their tours and albums between 1979 and 2007. Man, I got a million great stories of those guys. They're all like such interesting people. As a group, they made terrific music together. But as we all know, just because people sound good together doesn't mean that they're not necessarily gonna be tight buddies all the time. Sometimes there would be disagreements about music that had nothing to do with content, really. It was more just, you know, well, he likes it, so can't be right. There would be disagreement about, well, that's the fourth tune of his that we did today. Stills always had a pretty good idea what he was looking for, and, you know, when he'd write a song. And Crosby, he's a great artist, man, a great singer and wrote some really interesting songs. I mean, Miles Davis covered a couple of his tunes, so that's not too bad. He write a song like Deja Vu. That tune's got a million changes, and it's like, if you're a musician, the first time you hear it, you're, the fuck is that? If I had ever been it before, I would probably know just what to do. Don't you? And he always tunes his guitar, all these bizarre tuning. He doesn't know what the hell he's playing. He tunes his guitar in, in ways that no one else does. So he gets these chordal combinations. He's just going by what he hears. And he can't tell you what it is. To him, it's not an E minor nine with the flatted fifth. To him, it's just this. <laughs> Still, when he was young, he was a stone genius. He really was. Stone genius, man. Great lyrical content, great songwriting sense, and he could really play when he was young, man. He played great. One of the best acoustic guitar players. His electric playing was good enough, I mean, and it got better, but his acoustic playing was fucking awesome. Nash, he was like the sane guy. You know, there's like, George is the what you call it one, and Paul's the cute one, and like, well, Graham was the sane one. He might smoke a joint and that was about it, but the rest of the time he was, you know, trying to, you know, get, put that in there. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to more Rock Talk TV.